Certainly not taking a day off from trying to get your information. Latest scam targets people as they try to re-enroll in health care coverage. Of course, it's that time of year, right? Mm -hmm. Our Colton Molesky talked with the experts to keep you ahead of these crooks. Unfortunately, these scammers just keep getting better and better, and they're checking the calendar as well and know that you're going to be trying to re-up that coverage. Fortunately, the Better Business Bureau says there are a few ways you can protect your personal information. And so we know the scammers are out there. And they are actively working to take advantage of you. BBB Director of Operations Erica Dilworth says the swindle right now is health care enrollment. You know, we uh, receive, you know, calls or, or sometimes it's on our scam tracker report where um, sometimes it's just been a, an attempt to take advantage of somebody or sometimes people do also fall, fall victim. Dilworth says her office has already received several calls alerting the BBB to this scam. She says the thieves are targeting either an instant payout or your social security or health care ID number. The other other way the scam works is if, you know, uh, maybe it's identity theft. Maybe they want to pretend to be you or maybe they want access to your bank account. You can guard yourself by using official websites to enroll or re-enroll, not giving any information to a number not off an official website, declining promotional gifts. Now, if you have been reached out to by a number or an email address that you suspect is a scammer, make sure you're also alerting the Better Business Bureau. You can find their website in a link on the 19 News website. They want to stay on top of those scammers as well. In Broadview Heights, Colt Molesky, 19 News.